welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here apologies for the clothing in the back just it's dry and okay it's been raining today it's fine um yeah welcome back um my name is hannah i'm a 26 year old mum of two a three-year-old little girl and a two-year-old little boy i am married um to jamie we have been married for four months <laughs> Four months now together six married four um and i thought today I, I just want to say to begin with we hit 900 guys we actually hit 900 i'm just going to show you it on the ipad uh hang on give me a second where is it you think i would know where things are it's my ipad Nine hundred. Where is it? Where is it? Can you see it? Can you get? I'm in the way. Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? Nine hundred subscribers. What? That is just so crazy to me. Uh, me and Jamie are gonna get the um, Q and A filmed. Don't worry, guys. That is in the works. We're just. With his shifts and the kids, we're just trying to figure out a good time where we're not going to be interrupted by children. And he's home. So we may get a film tonight because he does have finished work a little bit earlier tonight than usual. But we'll see how he feels when he gets home. So, yeah. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. This video is... Um, I'm going to do some meal planning. I'm going to just prep basically for um, what I need to buy from the shops tomorrow. So I am going to go and do the food shop tomorrow after I finish work. Um, I, excuse my hair, my, it's freshly washed to begin with. So it doesn't want to do anything I want it to do. I've had it in a plait. It's a little bit curly. I uh, just, yeah. So we're just going to ignore that. I'm probably going to put it up in a minute. Um, but yeah, I am going to go through my fridge and freezers and cupboards and sort out make a list of everything we've got so then we can figure out what we're going to make for the week i do want to obviously write a meal plan just to save a little bit of a little bit of money a little bit of time um and a little bit of mental capacity each night when i have to decide what we're having for tea um if i see it there i'm like right i know that's what we're making let's make it um because i've kind of been a bit of oof, all over the place um, for, for the last few weeks. I still have some of them freezer meals in the freezer, so that just proves that I'm doing something wrong. Um, yeah, I, I'm i gonna go through the freezers. I mean, I've got like nothing in my freezer. There's like some bread, some brownies I bought from Farm Foods, um, a pizza, I think, which was so disappointing. I'm so disheartened by the pizzas. Because normally they used to have like the cheese crust, it's, and it was actual cheese, like stringy cheese, good cheese, worth the money. And now they've replaced it with like a sauce, and it's just not the same. Do not recommend them pizzas, I wouldn't waste your time. I think Tesco's do a cheese stuffed crust pizza for like three quid, and it is amazing. Um, and I paid like five quid for each of them ones, so... I mean, they were on offer when I ordered them from Mercado, but still, don't waste your money, not worth it. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go on my iPad and get my list sorted for everything we've got, and then I can figure out, we can figure out together what we're going to make this week. Right. Apologies if there's any mess in the background, we've just had tea. Um, you're going to hit the kids, they're playing. Um, right, I've done my... Um, Thank you, my Bobby. My fridge is very barren, but hang on, let me see if I can. I don't know, I can do this without like, dropping my iPad. Um, so I've got all the cupboard stuff. The fridge, all I've really got in the fridge that's going to be kept over is carrots um, and some potatoes. What I might do. Um, My iPad has a crack. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna have to ignore that. Um, that's actually really upsetting. 
How has that even happened? Is that under the glass? It's not even like... Oh, that's really upsetting actually. Anyway, um, yeah, cupboard, fridge, and a freezer. Um, and I have obviously Monday, Tuesday. A thing right now, I will um, do this on screen with you so you guys can just see what meals I can be bothered to put together. And then I need my phone. Um, oh, that face me. Oh. Hang on, let me get my notebook so I can do what I need to buy. So this is what we're having, uh, I'm going to do it from tomorrow, so tomorrow's Thursday. Um, so we're going to have the jack of potatoes with tuna and the kids will have the tin of meatballs and the rest of the pasta that's in there. Friday I'm going to take, obviously I need to take that chicken and treats thing out like tonight. Um, we're going to have the chicken treats with rice. Saturday is eggs, toast, beans and sausages just because um, we've got one of our friends at work she's getting married so um she's having like a do and she's got food and stuff there so i'm just going to give the kids some it light so they're not end up being sick and stuff sunday i've got family coming around um we're having a little get together you know hot dogs burgers whatever hopefully the weather's nice uh monday is kebab meat and chips that kebab meat from home bargains is at one pound fifty something and we had a kebab from um the takeaway and it was horrendous in comparison to this one pound fifty something kebab meat from home bargains uh, pizza uh, Tuesday is chili con carne for Jamie and Riley. Me and Isabella don't like it, so we will have the pizza to use that up. And on Wednesday, I will make a lasagna, which will use up obviously some of the lasagna sheets, um, carrots. Um, obviously, I can make a cheese sauce and things like that. So, yeah, this is a rough thing of what we're going to do for dinner for this next week. And I am I'm just fed up. I'm just trying to use up them freezer meals. They've been going for months at this point. Um, yeah, this is a rough estimate, so, um, or a rough, what's the word, a rough idea, um, I just need to write a list of the stuff that we need, um, obviously to do what we need to do. stuff because we always need more stuff um that we need some more cat litter uh sponges spray um eggs you can hear the kids um some more wraps because i think we used them up today yeah, and that's about it. This one is not the one we want. That was last week's. Um, so yeah, I mean obviously I will deviate from this a little bit and get other stuff that we probably don't need. Um, but I just let the shop tell me what I need. Um, but I think I'm going to start buying in preparation for Christmas again soon, which is like, oh my God, Christmas is like seven months away. But I would like to buy a little something each week to like build up a, uh, it's not a collection, a surplus. Is that the right word that I'm looking for? I don't know. Um, 
and I would go see you can actually see me. Um, but yeah, I like to buy a little something each week, whether it's like a pack of Pringles or some biscuits or chocolate or whatever. Obviously, I check the date, make sure it's long life enough to last till Christmas. Um, and if you guys have been around long enough, you'll know that I did it last year um, and I think the year before. But the year before, I was only just kind of starting YouTube, so um, I probably didn't film that one. But um, yeah, I like to just grab a little something, and as things run off, I like to buy them and put them away. And then come Christmas time, I haven't got the stress and worry about being like, oh my god. I mean, we don't really eat that much more at Christmas anyway. Um, but it's just always nice to have the goodies in the house. Anyway, I'm hoping this week that the Pepsi Max Cherry is on offer. children if you're new here you know that they uh, you don't know that they like to scream as soon as i press record it's like they know let me check hang on i told you it's just like they have a sixth sense are they saying that now that i'm not having as much pepsi i love this bottle i got it from primark if you saw that video it was like five pounds i just love it it just reminds me of like summer and if i have a cute bottle i'm gonna drink more like water and stuff. I'm not too keen on water, but I do like to have juice. Um, so instead of having Pepsi, I've been having that. Which has kind of been helping my headaches. I feel like I get the major headaches because I'm like dehydrated and stuff. So I try and um, keep on top of drinking plenty of fluids. But anyway, that's not what this video is about. Um, yeah. I'm going to leave it here then, I think. Um, Go and referee the kids because all they do is argue and I will see you guys again. For me it's tomorrow, for you it'll be in a minute, um, when I get home with the food shop. Guys, welcome back. I've been shopping. It's like two days later. I was going to go shopping yesterday, which was Thursday, but then my car decided I didn't want to start. So then I had to call the AA. Well, Jamie's stepdad came and gave me, tried to give me a, a jump start, but it just wasn't happening. Um, and I had to call the AA and then he came and he was telling me that I don't know because I've got like a start stop motor and all this other stuff my battery needs more than what a normal car can give and all that kind of stuff so um <laughs> shop daddy um and so anyway he hooked it up and whatever went out this morning it didn't have it wasn't working with that fob, so I was like, oh my god, the battery's obviously died again, we're going to have to... I've been around to spend £90 nearly on this pissing AA thing. Um, just to be covered for home start until my renewal in June. I think it's like two weeks, less than two weeks. And, um, and um, yeah, anyway, uh, so I went out this morning to put my bags in the car before I went to work, and my fob won't work, and I was like, oh crap, my battery's obviously died, I'm going to have to invest in a new battery. And then I got home, opened the car itself, and the car started with that fob, but it had to be in this certain area in the car. So I come back in and grab my other fob. That's sad. It's stones, baby. Um, grabbed the other fob that I had, and that works perfectly fine. So I don't know what's wrong with this other fob. I don't know what's happened. But fingers crossed and touch wood. My car's okay. Hopefully. Anyway, I've done the Tesco shop now. I did take some snacks and a drink, just in case my car broke down halfway home. Um, but we're fine. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna tell you what I bought. Um, let me just grab my receipt. The children are playing on the floor behind me, so if you hear them rustling bags, that's that's why. Right. It came to. Originally 157.75, but I had 27.33 in promotions, 9.60 off of 10% shop, and £2.20 off of Club Card Plus brands, which gave me a total of total savings of 39 pounds and 13 pence. So my total came to 118 pounds and 62 pence. It's not a very big receipt, but I did get some bulkier items, and I will show you some stuff when. Yeah. Anyway, to begin with, I got some eggs. I got Jamie some more of this stone. Two more bags of this stones because he needs them. They were like two for six pounds, I think. Riley. I'm leaving them there, and that's his problem now. Riley, um, got the kids some 
Nappies, those are always need nappies for them. Are you sitting on the stones? Um, I've got some of these crisps. These kind of crisps are mainly for Riley because he's the only crisp. He can't eat our crisps just yet, whereas Isabella can. She can have them. Whoever wants them can have them, but they're mainly for Riley. Got some cupcakes for the kids to have for pudding. Grab some more filters for our Tesco filter um, because we've had that one in there since we bought it. I don't even know when we bought that. Months ago, it feels like. Um, some tomatoes. Um, some more socks. But just look how cute they are. They've got little pants on. And then like striped socks. I can't help it. I'm obsessed. I got with Father's Day in mind, I got these for him, Jamie. Um he's going out anyway, so he won't see them. But I got this to put into his little bag thing that I'm doing him. Um got some shortbreads, these are so good. I mean they're not as good as my ones when I make mine, but <laughs> they're still pretty good. Just be careful you don't hurt yourself on the stones. Um, some more wipes. We really just use this mainly for the table. The table, this was a £113 table. Can you see it? Not including the, the boxes. Where is it? Not including the boxes. But four chairs and the table is £113 we got off of Amazon. I thought that was a bargain. Anyway, two packs of small apples because they're on offer at the minute. I think they're like instead of 99p, they're like 69p or something. Um, two tomato passatas. I just like to have them in the cupboard. Some crisps um, for whoever wants them. We do still have some crisps in the cupboard, but I just grabbed them. Oh, it's gone. Um, some bin liners. Some of these crinklies, because we're having like a little get together on Saturday. Um, no, Sunday. I mean, I might eat these with the kids. I don't know yet. It was cheaper just to buy two bags of the six packs, but this was already in my trolley. I'd already scanned it. It was way down at the bottom and I couldn't be bothered to find it, so for future reference. No, don't sit on the stuff, baby. You can sit on the stones, but don't sit on the bags. For future reference, it's more expensive to buy two bags of six, but you get more in there. Anyway, some sponges. This massive jar of hot dogs. Um, I think we're going to keep this one. I do have another jar of these, which is the smaller one for Sunday. Uh, by the time you guys are seeing this, it will be Sunday, so it will be today. Anyway, some lettuce, some kitchen roll. I was going to go to Home Bargains, but I didn't want to tempt fate with the car, so I just went to this place. Some cucumber, some oranges for the kids. They have, my Tesco's don't even sell, um, my Tesco's don't even sell the Tesco's own barbecue sauce anymore. Um, and this was £2.50. Um, just be careful, which hurt my soul to buy them, but... Uh, can't have burgers uh, without gherkins, so obviously needed gherkins. Uh, also got Jamie these milker, these this milker. It was reduced from like a pound to eighty-five p. Um, I did get these. These are on the shop me map. I am going to do a video of it, um, just simply because it's amazing and I love it. And I mean, sometimes most of the stuff on there is alcohol, but I'll get into it all um, when I do that. But these are for the shop me map. Two loaves of bread uh, that aren't squished, surprisingly enough. Um, I did well with that. Um, some wraps. Some hot dog rolls. I've got two lots of them just because um, one lot will be for Sunday and one lot will be for whenever we have the other hot dogs. Um, some squashed uh, burger rolls. I think Isabella's just sat on these. Um, so I didn't know how many burgers people were having, but then I've only bought four burgers. Oh well, only four people are having burgers. Okay, I forgot to pick some more. Um, got the cats and biscuits. I wish they did cats biscuits in the same size bags they do dog biscuits. I'm going to show you in a minute. These are like three pounds for me. Got me some dog biscuits. Got some Supreme Little Duck toilet roll. This is 4 dollars I think it's the same. Mommy. Same as 
same size, Mommy, same size as the home bargain. What's this? Don't touch it, baby. It's dirty. It's rubbish. And I did pick myself up some Pepsi Cherry because that was an offer for seven pounds a case. Yeah, don't touch it, baby. It's poop. It's not poop. It'll probably be food. Um, I've got some anti-back spray. Two lots of Scotch pancakes for the kids. I got these with Isabella in mind because she starts school. What, baby? Cereal. It's okay, don't touch it then. I got these with Isabella going to school in mind because they're um, in September because obviously it starts to get a bit cold. They're very warm, warm plus thermal kids long sleeve tops. I don't know, they were down from £8 to £5, £5 to £3.50. And then they have 25% off of full clothes. So obviously 25%, they were like £2 something. And I was like, you know what, for £2 something I may as well get both packs. Because when she's growing out of them, Riley can have them. Yeah. Right, these are also on the Shop Me Map. They're £5 a pack, but uh, you could try them for a pound. So, again, I'll get into all that when I film that video. Last bag, guys. Some cheese curls. These are amazing, I'm not going to lie. Um, some breaks for the kids. Some choco hazelnut flavour like breakfast bars. That's what I live off of um, six days a week when I'm at work. Um, some raspberry go-ahead things there for Jamie. Shop me a map. Just a little thing of cheese. A big old punnet of strawberries. These are down from £3.50 to £2.80, I think. Um, but they smell really good. They look like pretty decent strawberries. So, got them. Some butter. Some sausage rolls for Jamie. Mm. Some sweeties for Isabella because she asked for hearts. Look, Mummy got you some hearts. I want to eat it. What'd you say? Please. Please, good girl. Yum. Oh, just have they smell good. Smell them. Mm. Oh. Go sit down nicely with them then. Just have one at a time, okay? Okay. Um, some savoury eggs for the kids to nibble on at lunchtime, so they don't fancy a sandwich or something. Some yogurts for Jamie. Ice cream prices is ridiculous. Oh my God. So I just went for the, this isn't the cheapest, but it's the next one up. And this was still like two pounds something. But I remember when I, anyway. Oh, just, yeah. Um, also got this for Jamie to put away for Father's Day. Um, it's all right, because he doesn't watch my videos. <laughs> um, some bananas for whoever wants them. Some yogurts for the kids. These were the burgers that I bought. I only got four. But then there's hot dogs. And I've also got um, some else for my brother's partner because she is pescatarian. I've got chicken nuggets. We'll just, it'll be fine. We've got loads of stuff. Um, yeah, as long as I've got Taylor sorted, that's all that matters. Everyone else will just deal with what we've got. <laughs> um, some cheese slices for obviously the burgers. You can't have burgers without gherkins and cheese slices. Some milk, and well, that's basic, guys. And the last thing I bought. I like cups. Are they you, me? Yeah. Go sit down, eat the bottle. Okay, okay, well, we'll see how your belly feels, okay? Um, and the last thing I bought was just some fridge raiders, just to bung in the fridge. That's everything I bought, guys, for a hundred and. What did I say? hundred and something pounds. Um. I mean, the biscuits were £10, basically. These water filters, they were £6. The Pepsi was £7. The toilet roll was £5. Jamie Stones was £6. Um, I mean, these were £10. But obviously, I'll get that money back, so... Yes, baby. I'll sit on the rocks. You want to sit on the rocks? Come on, then. Yeah. Um, but yeah, guys, I am going to do a video explaining the whole Shop Me a Map. It's sometimes a bit hit and miss, but sometimes you get really, really good stuff on it. Um, like these are £5 a pack, but you buy them um, and you can try them for a pound. So you buy them, send off your bits and pieces and you get £4 back per bag. Uh, but obviously, I've got one for me and one for Jamie because we both have the app. Um, but yes, I will explain in much further detail on the video that I make. Just It'll just be a bit 
easy for people that people that want to know about it can then watch the video and stuff um but i think i've got like 60 quid back nearly um using it so uh yeah anyway guys i'm going to leave this here and i will see you guys in the next video i hope you've enjoyed it oh and also if you like this content please feel free to like share subscribe it all means so much to me we're so close to a thousand we're in that last hundred mark um to get to a thousand um and i am doing a giveaway don't forget guys um but yeah thank you so much and until next time